Good morning, everyone. It's good to see you again. Last week, we finished our I Spy series, where we learned for two months all about the things that were written in the Bible so that we can believe in Jesus. Now we're starting a new series all about how God made us. So if you look in a mirror, you can look and see just how different you are from everyone else around you. That's because God made you to be unique. There is no one else just like you, but God made you special just how you are. So I want to start off today by going over our brand new memory verse, okay? It's really simple this month. So we're, the memory verse is, I am fearfully and wonderfully made, Psalm 139, 14. Now, when you do this memory verse, I really want to see those muscles, okay? Let's do it again. Are you ready? I am fearfully and wonderfully made, Psalm 139, 14. Great job, everybody. All right, we're going to go ahead and get started with our praise and worship songs. So everybody stand on your feet and let's sing. I love the way that God made me Wake up in the morning and I wiggle my toes Wiggle my toes oh. I stretch out my arms and I'm scratching my nose Scratching my nose Treat 
Great singing, everyone. Now it's time for, you guess it, it's time for Ollie. Let's call him. Who, 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 who. Know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder. friends and welcome to the clubhouse. It's me, Lucy, and I'm so happy to see you today. My friends and I were just doing something super duper fun. Do you want to know what we're doing? I'll give you a big hint. That's right. We're taking silly photos of each other and we have all these crazy props to use like this. And like this. And even this. This has been the best day ever. Say cheese. Ho, ho. It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Ho, ho. Taking pictures today, are you? Hi, Ollie, I sure am. My friends and I have been having the best time taking silly photos and holding up these crazy props. Just look at this nose. Everyone's eyes, nose, and mouth are different. It's true. I have a story about who made them for you. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. And done. <laughs> Hola, friends. I'm Luis, the handyman. <laughs> it's so good to see you. Do you want to see my painting? You do? Okay, get ready. Ta-da! <laughs> I painted a picture of me, myself. <laughs> See, my brown eyes and my brown hair. I'm just a beginner, but I think I did a pretty good job. Which reminds me of a story. Do you want to help me build it? Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Ooh. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. Yep, we've got everything we need. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible is about the maker of all people. Who do you think it is? Hmm? God, that's right. God made everyone and he made us to be like him. But no two people are the same. It's true. Some people are girls. Some people are boys. Some have red hair. Some have black or blonde or brown hair. God made us all in the most wonderful way. He created people with fingers and toes and ears and eyes. God created people with legs and arms and a mouth and teeth. God even gave us a brain to think. Incredible, right? God is amazing and he made us to be like him. Now, Speaking of our brains, God gave us very special brains. God made us to learn. It's true. There are so many things we can learn. We can learn how to talk and tie shoes and read books and ride a bike. There are new things to learn every day. In fact, we're learning about God right now. And God made us so creative. Who here loves to dance? Ha huh? <laughs> ha, good. Who here loves to sing? Ooh, great. And who loves to build towers with blocks? Awesome. 
That's because God made us creative, like Him. And do you know one of the best things we can do with our amazing, wonderful, creative selves? Help others. Yes, God made us to help. We can help others by painting get well cards, or helping clean up, or saying kind words. Huh, isn't that amazing? God made us to learn, to create, and to help. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who made you? God made me. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who made you? God made me. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios! So there's your story, and it's all true. God made all of us special, and that includes you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, that is so cool. God made all of us. We are all special and unique in every way. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Good! Hey, I have an idea. Can I take your picture? When I say, say cheese, show me the silliest face you can make. Are you ready? Say cheese! Wow, that was awesome. Good job, everyone. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Psalm 139, 14. One more time. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Psalm 139, 14. What a great Bible story. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for a place where we can learn that you made all people. Thank you for making us to learn and think like you. Thank you for making us to be creative like you. And thank you for making us to help others like you. Help us to see your wonderful creations every time we look in the mirror or at another person. We love you, God. In Jesus' name, amen. So don't forget this week that God made you and you are very special. So whenever you look in the mirror, you can look and tell yourself, I'm special because God made me. And guess what? Why don't you tell your mom and dad that too? Why don't you look at them and say, you are special because God made you. I hope you have a great week and we'll see you next time. Bye.